Hello everyone, I am Khanam and this is my 7th video in react series. In this video we are going to create some simple challenge whatever we have learnt till now. We are just going to revise all the concepts we have learnt. Okay, uh, in this previous video we have seen this JSX elements. Okay, what is JSX elements and why these are used. Okay, and I have this output and here I have this output for that. Now I am just going to delete this entire thing and now we are going to create that challenge. Here I have this question. First, I have to import React and React DOM modules. Okay, we are going to write completely from the scratch. So I'll be importing React and I have to import from that node modules folder and I'll be importing one more file React DOM, React DOM from React DOM. Okay, these are my modules which are present inside my node modules folder. Okay, you can either require or you can directly import these modules. Okay, next we have we have to display one heading using JSX elements. Okay, to display we have to call our render method. I will be writing this react dom, react dom dot render method and this method will take two arguments. First is what should be displayed and second where it should be displayed. What should be displayed is h1 and I will just give the heading as shopping, shopping items and second is where it should be displayed. I'll be writing this. I'll just access this one document dot get element by ID using my selector get element by ID. I'll be accessing my root which is present inside my index dot HTML folder. Okay, you can see here inside index dot HTML. I have this diff which is having the ID as root and here I'm just accessing this ID inside index dot JS. Now if I show you the output, you can see here I am having this heading shopping items. Okay, I'm done with the heading. Now next I have display paragraph using JSX element. Now below this I have to display one paragraph. I will be writing this lorem. I will just give it 10. Now I will be getting this error because JSX element should be wrapped inside the parent. Now instead of wrapping inside diff, I will be wrapping inside this syntactic sugar form. You can either use articles, we have sections, we have main. Instead of that I am just wrapping this inside this syntactic sugar form. I will save this. Now if I just refresh this one, you can see I am having this paragraph. Now next I just have this create ordered list and display 5 shopping items. Okay, here I will be creating ordered list and inside this I have to display 5 list items. So I will just give li into 5 and I will be having this 5 li's. Inside this I will just give here rice and second I will be giving tea powder and next I want to shop Next, I'll be giving sugar. Next, I'll just give here oil. And last, I'll be giving here wheat. I'll save this. Now, if I just refresh this, you can see I'm having this heading. I'm having this paragraph and I'm having this ordered list. Okay, these are the JXX element. We are importing these two modules, React and React DOM. And React DOM is for a render method. And this render method will be having two arguments what should be displayed and where it should be displayed. Okay, it should be displayed inside index.html root. Okay, this container and inside this index.js I'm having all this. Okay, this is my first argument and this is my second argument. Now, if I just inspect this one. Now, this entire thing, whatever I have written that will come inside my index.html file. Inside this div which is having the id root, you can see I'm having this heading. I'm having this paragraph, I'm having this ordered list. Okay, inside whatever I have written here that will be stored inside this div container itself. And this div is present inside my index.html. Okay, this one here. Okay, I'll just close this one. Now, if I just view page source, you can see inside this page, I'm not having anything what I have written here. Okay, I'm not having this output, but I'm having this div which is having the root ID and inside this itself, all the code will be displayed. Okay, this entire thing will be displayed. Okay, this is all about our first challenge. We have revised whatever we have learned till now in this challenge. You can add many things here. If I just want to copy, if I just want to display one more ordered list, I'll just paste that one. Now, if I just refresh this, you can see I'm having this ordered list here. Okay, you can give anything here. Okay, you can just write your own code and you can explore this one. Okay, that's all for today's tutorial. In next tutorial, we are going to learn about JSX expression. We are going to learn completely about that and we will understand where it will be useful. Okay, now that's all for today's tutorial. Thank you so much for listening. Have a great day.